As you guys reach the surface, part aqueducts, you might encounter some blood fist company soldiers fighting in the streets. Their figures cloaked in black, cloaked in purple. And we see cultist magic at work. You see rain of like bullets and arrows going everywhere. It's so cumbler. Oh, yeah, definitely. Uh, you hear, hear uh, lots of shouting. You see Heskin in the crowd commanding troops. Not too far off, you see uh, Titus, who uh, is basically commanding troops on the, on the outside. But um, as you crawl out uh, through the area, the aqueducts, the big aqueduct cave, a busy unfoot appears before you guys. He doesn't say much. He basically says, Go to Titus. Quick. He points towards where Titus is. And then he disappears in a cloud of smoke. He knows the fight somewhere else. What do you guys wish to do? Uh, I want to find Titus, I think. Yeah, Alright, sure. so you guys are making your way towards Titus. Yep. As you guys run towards him, you notice you guys. Clerics! And a bunch of clerics immediately uh, uh, pay attention to you and heal you all to full. And you're like, Quartermaster! And a bunch of uh, other uh, low tier soldiers come and bring some supplies. They hand you uh, two health pots each. That will do 48 plus 4. 48? Yes, 48 plus 4. Holy shit. And it goes right. like, Good, you joined the fight. Oh, no, sorry. Good, you joined the fight. You're not needed here. There's a problem. You need to head to the streets. I have a feeling she will be summoning something here. There's a dark spirit named me shouted. He called itself Fear. Apparently, the Reaper Squad encountered it. I need you to help me finish the fight. Are you all ready? Head through the darkest of town. And you can see that the sky is already darkened to heck. Oh, I'm more than ready. I yes, this is happening when you guys have the magic. Let's bring order to this city again. Well, Titus looks at you guys, especially Fendra, who's usually the de facto leader. What is your Amen. group? Do you have a name? We have a name? Thomas I Andrews don't think Meliela. we ever came up with one. Um. Offense oh, A, Melio. Balls. Crusaders? Crusaders, come on. Or no way. I'm gonna smack him upside the head if he actually says that out loud. Oh, uh, I say balls of the Z out loud. And then I smack you upside the head. Yep. How about Bastion Squadron? Bastion Squadron? I suggest it to the others. What do you guys think? Hmm. No, Bastille. <laughs> With like, like this, like that. No. Oh. What? That's an insult to like, a fucking historical event. So Bastille, the Bastille Squad. Yeah. Ah, fuck it. No, let's call it. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm fine with just Bast Bastion Squad. Oh, Bastion. Bastion or Bastille. Bastion. Yeah, Bastion. That's my sounds Bastion. better. How about, uh, egg leg? Alright, let's come, let's move on, please. <laughs> <laughs> so... Bastion. Is, is it Bastion? Is it final? Is it Bastion or Bastille, guys? Yes. Bastion. Bastion. Jamaican jerk. Okay. Um... Alright, Bastion it is. Uh, ba ba Bastion squad it is. There you go, then. <laughs> Moving for story's sake. Um, no, best of squad, very well then. Well, best of squad, you may, we may be dealing with a Dracolich. I don't know if you're ready for it, but I can't send any more hands to help you. You need to head over to this side. We paved the way. Oh, are you guys ready to head that way? Yeah. Yeah, let's do this. I touch you on the shoulder and say if you touch your book in this fight, I'm the Sony again. So, Ephedral touches... Uh, go ahead and say that again. I say, if you touch your book in these fights, 
I am disowning you. And apparently there's a disowning thing happening. There you go. Savage. Holy shit, we're tiny on this map. Yeah, so apparently everyone else is gigantic compared to us. Yeah. Sorry about that. <laughs> I have very few spells left, and I can't save spells to kill him. Uh, Fendrel, uh, I actually, I should roll me d20, I actually forgot to play. That's not too bad, I think that might be good. Anyways. Alright, good sir. Um, one of the, uh, Soldiers hands you four moon herbs. Do you consume one? A spell slot of your choice can be restored up to two. So you can restore two spell slots of your choice. Four moon herbs. Those goes. Oh yeah. So I can use all of them. How many do you want to consume? <laughs> all of them. All right, you consume all of them. Alright, so you may restore it. Plus, I'll see your choice. <laughs> okay, I look at here and say, okay, you can touch it. <laughs> hmm. Alright, as you guys walk into part of the squares of the city, notice Coldus are ready to meet you. you. See a different figure. She has horns and is wearing crimson, but. Ebony made uh, black made uh, I mean uh, armor made of uh, the darkest uh, black ebony and definitely obsidian. It's on fire. She's also wielding a very freaky looking flame chain of as a weapon. The figure across is the leader of the Savior Celerino. It's a cloaked tiefling, but looks like they seem mutilated. And two cultists are standing next to him. They seem to ha have an argument. The cultists next to them also basically tell their leaders. The two figures nod. The one holy cloak teleports away. These two cultists immediately start to mutate. Then the creatures that you met down below. Alright, everyone, roll me initiative. Bars. That's their health and their AC uh, demos. Which I will bring up over here. Okay. Nice! Oops, that should be. Okay. I'll be back in a minute. And Mele, Mele Yella, do you recognize this song, by the way, buddy? Oh, shit. How you doing, by the way, dude? How's everyone doing this stream? Hope you guys are enjoying Indini, &E, having the funds. Creativity, okay. He might still. Final Fantasy Tactics is here. I wonder where Mecha King went. Hope he's alright. Let's see him again. I thought well, I was gonna do the whole Dota thing for him, too, because of. A black hole, black hole, a Whoa, this map's huge, dude. Yes. All right, this guy. Leap across. Here, and you guys are out of range, so it will end its turn. Go, kid, you will move. But don't, oh god, Melio, please. I'm going to go. Let's see. Oh. So that takes all my oh, moves, this map is bigger. That happens, Shaman. Um, I'll, um, I'm going to move to the roof, about here, and ready in action. Alright. 
Is that all you shall do? Yep. Move to the roof and ready to action. This very well. You're in it, her turn. This is Zenbod. This is your turn. Close. You from Krogan? Here you go. Mr. a frogman. Throw up a grove. I stand my ground. Bye. Right. Yeah, I can't do anything anymore. Okay, yeah. This this cult is. Courtney will take a bow and shoot at it, you. A bow, right? Take a bow, and it's 20. You may shoot. Uh, you can just catch the arrow, can't you? Oh, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, you can try to catch the arrow. Yeah. I believe it's, uh... Uh, let's see. Do you know how to catch, uh, do you know the ruling for you catching an arrow? It's just the whenever you get shot by an arrow, you roll like dex plus monk level plus a d10. So he has a, and that's how much damage it reduces. So he has a minimum of like 15 damage that it reduces. He still got the roll, right? So he's level 15. He it doesn't mean have to because he basically catches it. He has a reaction. So it's yeah. Fine. yeah, you basically just catch it. No damage. And you can spend the key point to throw it back. You spend the key point to throw it back? No. I throw it on the ground. Threw it throw on, it the, on ground. the ground. Yeah. <laughs> wow. It's DD, dude. You just got terrible. I'm out, guys. Aww. <laughs> wow. Hey, man. Don't, don't hate. <laughs> what the fuck, ever? You can leave. You're. <laughs> Your na attempted name for their group was literally Balls, so... <laughs> I think Knuckles is that. Yeah. He's like, fuck you guys. Alright, Mr. Zanpa, he's gonna hit you with some fire! Can I- can I grab fire? No, mm -hmm. you can't grab fire. Only physical projectiles. How about you grab a lightning bolt? But, as he curls two fire. fireballs at you, they miss. You must have dodged them very expertly. Oh. And Mr. Grok is your turn. Alrighty. I'm... No, the D20 was the attack roll. <laughs> Ten is the damage. this guy? Is. Not too far. I'm essentially the tank, Kappa. <laughs> yeah, fuck it. I'll climb up the roof and run up to this guy. Do I need to make a check for that, or can I just climb up? Uh, what's your base strength score? Uh, I have a plus five okay. to my strength. You like your your total strength score? I mean, oh, it's twenty. Yeah, so you, 20. You, you get him out the fuck up that thing. You're good. You're just basically muscle man. You're just like, whoop. The goblin's not with you this time. By the way, you know. What was that? Goblin's not with you. He died. His, it's the decide to stay at the Oh, barracks. I know. He left with the uh, alligator thing. Alright, uh, yeah, I guess I will rage and recklessly attack. Yep. 23 for 27, 19 for 30. That's all works. Okay, uh, does to hit. Oh, give, give me one second, uh... Oh, thank you. Uh, yes, then, if you could help explain. Uh, I'll give you one moment for Tuxedo, but just, uh, um, we'll give you Hannah. Uh, we're gonna give it away, but... Thank you for asking, and BD is easy to uh, get to. Alright, so you do swing the axe. Quink, quink, it does hit. And for how much damage you send it? Let me see if I can do this. The, do you get plus three or is it plus four at your level? That's plus four. Oh, uh, it's eight thirty-one. Forty-nine. Mister Grout. What was that? I think it's forty-nine damage, I believe, right? Uh, fifty-seven. Because okay. I have my rage damage. Oh, your rage. Okay. 
so as you blood. cleave into it, <laughs> wham, you do basically take like a good portion of like its chest cavity and stomach. You hit it pretty hard. I didn't like that. It's, it's basically screaming like. Wah. This cultist. We're gonna take a Gilkit. It'll miss, and that shall hit. Using a long sword. Oh yeah, I am. Um, Eleven he damage. He attacked me attack. my ready action. My ready action. All right, go for it. Use your reaction. Oh, good rotation. Tuxedo. Yeah, it's a very flexible tuxedo. Um, how DD works is pretty similar. It's between how, how for instance, it's like you have to talk to a dungeon master. Uh, so you and a dungeon master works together. And uh, I basically can explain like stats, abilities, rules to you in a very, very simple way. And I have a public game that. every Saturday that you can join. And also, we'll create a, a character sheet every now and then. But also on Friday, there may be open games as well if it is voted as the viewer's choice. Yeah, and you, you're more than welcome. But thank you for stopping by, by the way. And most of the uh, dice rolls you will be using is a 28 uh, sided dice. Well, probably or something. Uh, how many attacks are you doing? Uh, um. You only roll it once. What do you, what do you want? Uh, um. Uh, didn't know I could actually stop it twice. Okay. Well, you held your action. Yeah. Alright. There we go. There you go. So you circumcise uh, twice with your speed. So he runs at you and swings at, at the long sword. You clash. Um, after he strikes you along your arm, you turn around and you spare him right to the gut and right to the chest. <laughs> he didn't like that as well and he's being very profusely. Like with the demon across the way. Fendral's your turn. You're welcome, Red hey, You guys ready for science? Fucking science? Does you see this guy right here? I do. I cast that on him. Our firebolt. Would that hit? That does hit. Does he take damage? He does take damage. Awesome. God, this game is awesome. I'll use this <laughs> six <laughs> to cast that. Okay, okay, and after a fireball, kaboom, the, the cult is like, oh, and it turns into sizzle on mozzarella fondue. <laughs> and delicious with mozzarella. And Basically, you I have your movement. fireball, inspect him for a second, <laughs> and destroy him. Yes. So, uh, use what movement you have, 30 feet, and Mr. Cork is your turn. Uh, you can't dash an attack unless you have the charger feet, in which case I think you would only get one attack. Oh, he's got it. He's got the charger feet. Dude, let's see. You are trying to attack from Let me below? Check this feet. Yeah, it's only one melee weapon attack. So you're trying to hit him from below. You're trying to hit him from below, right? What, what what are you doing? I think he didn't realize he couldn't dash an attack. Oh, he doesn't have the feet. There you go. Alright, well, that'll be your turn. Oh no, it's a creature thing with turn. Now move over here. There you go, kid. And instead, we'll hurl two fireballs to the face. Did you think? That one shall hit you. Oh. Yeah. That shall miss. So, uh, one fireball to the face. How's everyone doing so far? I know uh, some people are doing so well, but uh, what about the lurkers? Hope you guys are right. Thank you for supporting. Hope you guys are enjoying the DD show. Good. 
you'll take four, uh, nine fire damage to the face, and you shall like it. As it tries to cascade fireballs at you, whoo, you dodge one that was aimed at your feet, but the next one does hit you right in the stomach. What are your clothing's on fire? And it's now your turn. Good. Mm -hmm. It's your turn. Alright, um, I'm going to split up my attacks and... Like that's you might be a attack. Attack. Nice, Maliello. That was a little blur. Basically. Let the lickiness of this. I'm gonna move here and then stab both of them. Stab one each? Yeah. Okay. The first step shall miss uh, said demon, but the other one does hit the cultus. And he looks like he's about to keel over and die. Let's have a bonus action. As he just bleeds and coughs up blood. Oh. Okay, I'm just gonna put, um, kick the guy in the face then. Kick him in the face? Okay, and that will miss because of natural wound. Uh -huh. So you, you should have stomped him in the nuts in the side. And a Mr. Grog make me with the same throw as uh, you see the uh, black armor clan demon stretch out her hands and tries to clutch and hold you. Uh, 15? You managed to resist the magical entanglement that I tried yes. to do. Yes! This is uh, Mr. Hugh, it is your turn. You did DM 99% of the time. Oh, there you go then. At least you get to play here. Yes, uh, yeah, you're probably fine. Yeah, you're fine. Okay. You have a high, uh... Oh, I hit him with my attack with Flora Blows. Let's see. Ooh, your first one does hit. Just second one hit. Your third one does hit. So, your first strike. Well, bam goes on through it, but you try to duck Longo for an uppercut, but it barely grazes it when you manage to turn around for an elbow and a back fist to his face. Whoa, whoa, bam! And do your little combo and rhythm. Wait. I don't think you're adding your uh, dexterity to your damage in some of your macros. Yeah, you're, you're offhand. I thought it doesn't get bonus. I think Hello. I can't remember. It, it does doesn't. since Grand Day. It should. Actually. Yeah, it's, it's fine. Yeah, you just put the plus five. So I had a uh, that one. You'll get six extra damage on this. And so go ahead and fix your macro, and you will add your dexterity modifier your offhand. Okay. So should I change my plus four to something else for my main hand, or like what's up? No, no, it's your offhand. Your offhand. Oh, okay. Your offhand. Okay. Yes. Okay. This thing's turn. They're being bladed to heck. Right in law. Hey, let people. Okay. We're gonna try to attack him, Mr. Gr uh, Mr. Grog and Mr. Zian. So the claws will go to Grog and we'll go to Zian. Bring it. 21. Be your raging shield, you'll take the ass. I'll get you and Zian. Which will miss. Oh, I totally forgot I have Sentinel. Well, that's your fault. Yes, it is. But Dude. now, since he attacks then, I get to make a reaction attack. Go for it. And I'm still recklessly attacking, so BOOM! Uh, then it's a brute. <laughs> Brutal. So that'll be 42 damage. Okay. He will he also take a... 5... Five piercing damage from him, and uh, that is I said Fortinand, right? As it closes yep. to you, Ting Ting, and it tries to make one uh, attack towards uh, Zen. Uh, you see the opening, and you just whoosh, and cut its head off. Ah, I thumbs up. I thumbs up, I rock. Hey, good job, dude. I just give him a savage grin. And the Coldus will try to fight for its life and attack a go get. Uh, Natural hit. 
Your armor class, what is it? 19. Okay. I'll hit you with a long sword of 13 damage if you should like it. And Mr. Fenjaw, it's your turn. Mm. Okay. I am going to do science again. Ooh, she blinded me with science. <laughs> Uh, fancy looking lady up here. It's actually quite, you know, my type. So, before we go any further, is that your whole action? Yes. That's your whole action. And that's it, right? Were you attacking? This chick? Yeah. Ah, oh, a chick. Okay. As the fireball hits towards her uh, ch chest area, it basically swaps out the way, it does nothing. It just, just slaps it out of the way. <laughs> just right, like that. Yep. Asshole. I Get never noticed right how right far that is said dick to you. Ventrill is fighting very far range now. I'm not used to this. Right. So weird. <laughs> yeah. This is awesome. Tag with your lance. So, did you climb Ooh. up the roof? Looks oh, like I did. Uh, you s jam twice with your lance. Think you spear off an arm, and think you spear a body. Boltus is dead. The breeze is last breath. This guy. That go kid very ferociously. With tails and claws going at him in left and right and from the side. And Cor Corcoras says, Praise the red sun. It's nice to see you getting back in the DD. Yeah, you mellow yellow. Yeah. And all the sex shall miss a go kid. And go kid, it's your turn to react. Oh. What's up, crazy? Oh, you got an unlock mode? Oh, there you go. To this fucker. Huh? By spearing it in the face! Spirit eyes, boom, boom. You do imagine make some incision holes right in your shoulder and chest and measure you 15. What are you so excited about? Yeah, the fuck doesn't hit. Right? This creature on the other hand, oh, you guys are definitely here. I've done my duty. Have fun. And she casts a spell to teleport away. Alright, Mrs. Zen, it's your turn. Well, oh, shit, we forgot about her. No, we didn't forget about her, we were just kind of stuck on people. I can't really do anything. You can always dash. Let's see. And you could have just dash if you wanted to. Cross the way. I'll stay here. Alright, no Harker Parker. Alright. Mr. Grok. Yeah, this will be weird. Alrighty. Uh, I guess I will have to start running around over for that last guy then. Uh, damn it. I guess I'm gonna have to dash. Up down the building, scoot along the floor, climb up the thing. Okay. That'll be all for you? Yep. And Jaws, your turn. Ready to burst out on awesome! Good job, Trent, for making that command. Good job, Pete. Oh. How's everyone liking the D&D actions for it? Like I said, if anyone had any questions or whatnot, you can ask. Commands are for it. Okay. Mr. Cork. Put a cork in it. Okay. Yeah. That is a critical strike. Forty-seven. Cut that down in half. Twenty-three.
Jeff Frozen as a you did get one good strike with a weapon is the selling knight enchanted uh to do the max down with it. That was a bad I'll continue to rail out of go cat. Oh yeah. And that will be three crits in a row, my thank you very much. Yeah. Well, that one's dead. My dice is so hot. Huh? And he gets on really? one. Yeah. But Remember, I ain't got not the DM for doubt. Could you go with him? Who is that? That is Tico Cat. Alright, bye, my kid. Bye. bye. Enjoy the afterlife. Have a good day. Bye. <laughs> Seven? Uh, 17? 24? Oh, this is number damage. I'm alive, bitches! For now. And before, like, after effect, but like, towards and... the light. 37 damage. Good thing for that hell, uh, I'm alive, necklace 16. of constitution. Oh yeah, I'm alive you. with 16 health. Alright, go okay, it's your turn. Oh, look okay, at pissed off the fuck. Because, <sighs> you, you... How much HP I you have? Oh yeah, 16 HP. Oh, you bastard. I wish to spend two key points to make my... Give me the ability to use the spear fort. And two more times. I don't think that's how it works. Uh, what are you trying to do? I want to poke that fucker four times with two handed spear. So let's take a look. You're trying to flurry your blows, right? Yeah. It says two unarmed strikes yes. as a bonus action. So you mm. can just stab twice and then kick him twice. Yeah, you can do that. Fancy, that is the crit damage. Extra 3d6 was 5. Yeah, these guys don't hit very hard unless they do their freaky fire thing. Yes. Oh, wait, hold on. He is correct. I forgot something. The tail damage. I put the oh, tail. Oh, yeah, yeah with the poison and stuff. Oh, no, this one doesn't poison, so I have to roll another separate damage dice. In before yeah. 50 damage, boys. <laughs> In before unconscious, go get. Uh, 50 damage. Oh my god. Yeah, he said 16, health. right? 1 HP. One health. 1 HP dream. Thanks for reminding me, Banzi. He. I hate you, Banzi. <laughs> I go get. Good job, so It could it. be worse. He could have robbed you out of your fucking honor duel. Oh, yeah. I'm probably gonna kill your character eventually for that, Fancy. I hope you know that. Probably. Bitch. You try to lay in great vengeance and go kill, but when your strikes do miss uh, as you try to knee it, but you mostly successfully do get it with a kick and stab it twice with his face. <laughs> of course, it raises a little bit of lightning damage, but the, the weapon has brought full bear to its full power, but you do get some of, of demon flesh on your spear. I shall right, he your kill turn. this fucking abomination. I turn to hit, um, go get no, we can. I'm gonna <laughs> hit the monster. <laughs> if that dies in one hit, I'm just gonna do a one punch, man. Oh, as for the uh, critical damage, uh, this thing has flat extra critical damage. Yeah. And it did it for you guys. Hey, look at this way. At least it hasn't crit uh, damaged the magic for you guys yet, which I. Yeah. 
Thank you for giving me ideas, Banzi. Eh. No, God W is too. Alright, uh... It doesn't you bother me, I'm crit of you. I saw you punch, BAM! The next strike, Sally, does miss with the hook. But you do manage to kick, uh, hit with your next kick, BAM! 15 damage. How is this thing looks looking? Looks worse for wear. Very looks for wear. Lots of his flesh is like, just... Right. Bleeding and oozing. Oh, yo, Insomnia, what's happening, dude? Back. Wait. Am I, is this still my turn? Uh, I just calculated you your damage. Grok is your turn. Oh, okay. <laughs> Alright, reckless attack with my axe. Does the 16 hit. hit? Yep. Yeah, 29 damage. Is it dead? Nope. God damn it. You have Lock a second attack. Shit. There you go, he's dead. Yeah. As you lop its leg off, foom. Part of his mission, foom. And then off its head, wham. Oh, there you go. There you go. Aha, I kick the head aside and then ask our newly minted magic guy if he knows where that uh, lady teleported to. Can I make an arcana check? Gokat wants to drink the potent health potion. Wait, we Did still we left one guy alive? No, they're all dead. You killed them all. Holy shit. Tilt. Can I make an arcana check to see if uh, I can find out where she teleported to? Sure thing. Never mind. It's all good. Just ignore all this. You rolled a six. You I'll do not know where she may have gone. This corner over here, I'll just dig my face right into it real quick. <laughs> What's um, the I roll for a potion, health her. potion? 48 plus... Crap, I just... Where's my notes? It was yeah, 48 it. plus 4. There you go, 48 plus 4. Thank you. <clears throat> Sally, these things had no loot whatsoever. Can I, uh... I rolled There's to find where they are. Stuff. I appreciate well, it. wherever that female went. Thank God I've got some Arcana, help. um... This is magic you're not too, uh... In great expertise with. But it definitely had it way down the air where Titus wanted you to go. Apparently there is, uh, one of the cathedrals in the city that you're fading. Sort of summoning magic happening. Okay, and that's where Titus wanted us to go as well. That's definitely where, like, yes. this he, shit is going down. Uh, he asks you to stop the summoning that's happening. All right, let's go. Let's go sprint down over there and see if we haven't been delayed too much. No worries. Then. I guess I'll. I, I'll I, drink. I got something. No, 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 no. I got you. So, all I do. As you are, oh, don't forget to uh, put your HP stuff. By the way, go. I have. I put it back to what it was um, when taking potion. Right. I'm now 22 health. So, as you guys are rushing, holy shit, it's almost 3 a.m. No, Greta, you about to stop having thing. interesting things happen. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> my fault, my fault. All right, so here we go. As you guys are rushing forward um, through the battlefields, many people are dying. The Bluffers Company are doing the best they can. You definitely hear the shouts of Heskin, uh, Oz Odinson, and many warriors, and even Kurlock. There's many soldiers going about. But, um... Titus, you, you over here is yell, but um, Busy comes around and is like, make it to the temple. Quickly, before it's too late. And as you guys are rushing towards the temple, you break down the doors, and many soldiers are fighting uh, to the left and right. Things are going way hectic, but as you approach, you see the summoning has already happened. Approach the citadel, as the figure has finished the summoning. A Dracula is just being birthed. The figure itself looks at you as it's being formed. Hello again. Remember me from the mansion? I am. Yeah. But at the same time, 
you hear a rumbling and great noise coming from the side as the walls break down. I am the Herald. Let justice be done. That, ladies and gentlemen, is where we will leave you it off for today's episode. Oh yeah. That's oh yeah, good. that giant sasha from the mansion. Hype, hype, hype. 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 Gonna have a Dark Souls style battle where just <laughs> where we're just like rolling under feet and just desperately poking it in the butt. <laughs> Why does always the poke booty strat? Why can't we just have the poke booby strat? I, I want to poke tits, not ass all the time. Because it's not really females in Dark Souls. <laughs>